this will complete the underwater hull main deck down which is a significant milestone in, uh, in, our, in our quest to support launching this ship three months early next year. Um, right now, this is, uh, this is about a 760 metric ton super lift, um, comprised of tanks and uh, miscellaneous storerooms and whatnot. So that's what we have going today. And it actually feels good. Uh, I was here when they actually laid the keel uh, for CVS for this ship, and uh, it feels good. It, uh, watching all these big pieces come together, uh, watching the craftsmen and watching the pride that they put into this stuff, you can't help but feel proud seeing stuff like this going to the ship. So as we build the ship and we're, we're building larger and larger super lifts, then you still erect the same amount of steel but in larger pieces. So on CVN 8081, we're going to be down to about 300 to 325 lifts. Part of our cost savings uh, is uh, converting to a digital tool set for our mechanics. So rather than paper drawings and paper procedures, we now have a lot of the data on a tablet where they can go in, pull up the job in 3D, they can rotate it, they can get all the dimensions and get all the procedures that allows them to do their job more efficiently. We're building the ship differently in, in a number of different ways. One of those, as I said, is building larger sections of the ship on our final assembly platen and doing a lot of pre-outfitting before you go to the ship. The other one is the digital tools we're bringing to our mechanics so that all that data is then resonant right in their hands in a tablet to get that data. We're also doing a lot now where we're taking and breaking our, our plan down differently, what we're calling a, a virtual build management where we can have a model within the tablet that shows the schedule and each sequence of work that we have to do across our trades. What we do is, is unique. I mean, when I look at our workers, I don't look at welders and fitters and pipe fitters. I look at school teachers. Uh, I, I look at um, their mothers, their fathers, their children. You know, they got a life outside the shipyard or who they really are. When they come in here, they do something nobody else in the world does. And I think everybody's proud of the fact that when we walk through these gates, nobody in the world but us does what we do.